The cover in this week's Financial Mail was in two parts. One part, which, which I wrote, was about the, the macro picture. We hear a lot about Greece, and, and understandably it's a very dramatic story with lots of, lots of things going on. But um, the, the much bigger events from, from a South African point of view are the, the events in China. There's an economic slowdown, but not, not only an economic slowdown, but now as we know there is a, quite a, a meltdown in, in the stock market there because too many people are, are buying, buying shares on margin. Now the other big event is the Fed in the US, the Federal Reserve Bank, which is going to be increasing its interest rates soon. For the first time since 2006, that's a, that's a lifetime for a lot of people. A lot of people in the markets have never seen a US interest rate increase. And um, it could well go up to about three and a quarter percent within within six months to a year, and then perhaps peak at about five, five and a quarter percent as it did last time around. And this is going to have big implications for emerging markets because a lot of people have been investing in emerging markets in a search for yield, in a search for higher, in, higher interest rates than they can get on US cash. And if, if, if Americans can just, just put, put their money in cash, why would they want to, want to take it somewhere like South Africa, for instance?